Hello, in this video I'll show you how to work with individual fixed prices rules for each product. So, let's activate it. Save changes. Let's go to the our simple product and let's refresh its backend page. Now we can see uh, another tab, the product fixed prices. Okay. Uh, let's read it and add any rules, for example, for example, for any, any currency. Let's be GBP, for example. Add and let's be Euro. Let's set prices for these current products in currency GBP. Okay. Let's do it. for example this and this, and for euro this and this. Just for example, to understand what's gonna update. Let's look. Yes, it's safe. Uh, let Let's go to the our product here. And we can see that in GBP we we see this price, and in euro, yes, that's this data is works fine. Euro, GBP. Uh, okay, let's add in the card, for example, this euro add to card, view card, and uh, proceed. To check out. Of course, one thing, customer, customer can pay in the euro, or he he can pay in the GBP. For example, uh, let's go back, select GBP. And customer can see that in the JBP prices is lower. So where is the sense for all these manipulations? If we can't let the, uh, do something for let the customer pay in the currency of his region he came from. For this, we should go to the Geo IP rulers. Set tab advanced, select uh, this, uh, this feature. Check out by Geo IP rulers. Yes. Save changes. So, uh, let me set euro. Of course, it should be euro. So, it's, that's mean that the customer will be always pay in the currency which is set for him in the Geo IP rulers. Let's check it. So now I'm in the Spain and I will pay by Euro. Let's check it. Uh, so now you can see that we have check out in the JBP from the previous examples. Let's select it to check. Will I be paid with the euro? Yes. And look this on the prices. I'm paying by rules which I set for this product. So I set here as we have sell price 30 euros. So I'm paying here 30 euros. And it always will be in the euro. If I will place, uh, uh, if I will place order, uh, so I got for direct bank transfer, I will got this amount. Let's check for PayPal because it's more complex to transfer data to the PayPal uh, gateway. So we should see forty three point thirty seven. Blue. This should be thirty three point thirty seven. Thirty three. Point thirty seven. That's all. So it will be work. It will be work fine.
let's cancel it because we don't need it. <coughs> okay, so I hope you understood this feature. Uh, this feature is good marketing tool for your prices when you can manipulate with uh, with this uh, tool for your products. By the way, uh, question: What about if the country is not here? I just removed Spain from the rulers, GeoIP rulers, but we have checked by GeoIP rulers. But Spain is not here. In such case, customer will be paid as it was in the previous versions of the plugin. If this is multi-allowed, activated, but of course it's, will, it's activated always for this feature, in such case, user will be paid in his selected currency. So, I just remove it. Let's update the page. And we can see euro here. So, as the customer is not here, he will be paid as he was in the previous version of the plugins when is multiply allowed in his selected currency. I hope you understood. See you.